here at the world premiere for Dr. Cabby. It's where East meets West. We've got an exciting red carpet. You're hearing Salman Khan talking in the background. We've got it right here, T.TV. Deepak B. Chopra delivered a baby today. In the back seat of a cab. You know why there's such a shortage of doctors in this country? That's all you guys are too busy driving cabs. <laughs> when was the last time you had your prostate check? What? How are you? I'm good. What does an international project with Hollywood and Bollywood coming together, what does that say about the state of Bollywood today? I think um, it's always good to, you know, to to merge. It's always good to to make movies, and um, this this one was made, conceived in Toronto. You know, so it's not that much of us, as in the Indian cinema. It's more you guys, and it's your story, and we're telling you your story. I think it says a lot about Canada. I think that this is again. I'm saying, I find that very often Canadian films try to look like American films. And I've always been sad about that because first, we will never do American films as well as the Americans do. But maybe we can do Canadian films better than anyone else. <laughs> and so I think that the cross-cultural reality is one that we live, that we know, and we are probably the best ones to talk about it. Bollywood is is completely global right now. And I live in I live in Los Angeles. I was, you know, as I'm from Toronto, born in Toronto. And just the, you know, the global cast of this movie, you know, we have Katrina Cave's sister, Isabel, who's making her 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 world premiere in the movies. We have uh, Salman Khan producing, we have, you know, uh, Ajay and Vinay who are Canadian, we have Kunal and Adrian and Mercier who live in Los Angeles. I think it's just it, it just shows the global aspect of the Bollywood industry. And the movie's in English, so that's even, you know, it, 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 there's more of that coming along for Bollywood as well. I mean, I think it's a testament to show how much the world is becoming a smaller place. Particularly on YouTube when I make contents, like, the world watches things these days. Everything is connected. And I personally love it. I think it's phenomenal. I think in a few years, things like this will be a norm, and we won't even think about it anymore. Tell us about your character. What type of guy is he? He is uh, very simple, very naive. He's uh, a doctor from India. Uh, very studious, very proper, and when he comes here, he realizes his medical degree is not recognized, and uh, you know how he uh, starts to drive a cab, and the crazy people that he meets along the way. So yeah, wonderful. Well, thank you so much. You do great work. Have a great night. Thank you. I'm I'm a Toronto boy, so I love it. T.TV. Thank you. We read that you had a role in The Wolf of Wall Street. <laughs> Tell us about your role in The Wolf of Wall Street. I played um, I played Khalil in the in the in the movie. I was one of the stockbrokers in the movie. Uh, you know, I, I had an amazing time. I worked for six weeks so with uh, Leonardo DiCaprio and Martin Scorsese, and uh, it's one of the it, it's one of the, mo the highlights of my career. And you know, it's just been one of those things. Next up, I just actually shot a movie in Japan, a Ridley Scott film, uh, with Guy Pearce and Jackie Weaver, and um, and Kristen Stewart. So it's it's been one of those things where I. Um, you know, I, I, I'm I'm very blessed to be able to to be in this business, and uh, I'm just so happy to I'm just so happy to be here and you know be doing doing the stuff that I love. I just think it's awesome, man, that everybody's collaborating together. Beautiful people coming out. You know, this is where we live in. We're, this is the reality. You know, so just show it up in the movie. You know, it's pretty cool. I've been to India on tour before and had a great time over there. And it's like the vibe that they brought from India, from Toronto, and mashed it all up into one thing. It's it's amazing, and I think it's dope. It represents properly.